horn and helmet. A S M R. Thank you for watching. Good evening. I'm just making my final rounds before I go off shift. Are you comfortable? No. Believe it or not, I understand. Despite working here, I know that the hospital is not a very comforting place to be, even at the best of times. But I have accessed your file and I am pleased to report that everything is going to be just fine. You have not been discharged yet, as a formality, for observation purposes only. The doctors want to be sure that there will not be any complications or relapses, but that is not expected. By this time tomorrow, you should be home in your own bed. Me? I suppose I could sit with you for a minute. There are not many other patients on this floor, and you are the last one on the hall. If you prefer... I could call the nurse's station and request one of them to come and sit with you instead. I know that the presence of another human can be preferable. You do not mind that I am a drone? You would be the first, you know. I have had patients bar me from their rooms out of a misplaced sense of self-preservation. I do not blame them. I am aware of how unsettling some drones can be. Even the ones who allow it only tolerate me, and usually keep one hand on the call button for the nurses. I am not complaining. Again, I do not hold it against them. But you are very kind, and I appreciate the gesture. I am surprised you are still awake. It is very late, and you need your rest for recovery. You cannot sleep. Here, let me help you with that. I will never understand why they have the monitor's volume on when everything is watched remotely. There. That must be better. You are still nervous? There is nothing to be nervous about. As I said, you will be discharged tomorrow afternoon and sent home. I am sure you will be far more comfortable in your pajamas than a hospital gown. I have been told that they are not pleasant to wear. You know, if you like, I can help you sleep. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Nothing like that. As part of my training, as well as to help my understanding of humanity, I worked as an orderly in the maternity ward of this hospital. I did not interact with any of the patients at that point. I was making beds, fetching ice, small tasks that were inconsequential. I saw so many babies being brought into this world, each time different from the last. But everyone did the same things. They held the baby's hand in their own and sang to it. 
Would you like to hold my hand? I have freshly sterilized it, so I assure you it is clean. No, I do not mind. I would not have offered if I did not mean it. There, I have you now. Just relax. I will stay with you until you get to sleep. Would you like a lullaby? I remember the ones that the nurses would sing to the babies in the ward to get them to sleep. Not that you are an infant, but I know that it can be helpful when you are in an unfamiliar place or situation. Of course, it is no problem. Glowworms show the path we have to tread. Dreamers, we should be asleep in bed. Moving slowly through the springtime air. Holding moments in the depth of care. Holding moments in the depth of care. Whisper fairy stories till they're real. Wonder how the night could make us feel. Loving, living, more with love to stay. Long past sadness that was in our way. Long past sadness that was in our way. Dawn time mist begins reflecting light. Waking sun will soon forget our night. Love me through the day and all with you go into summer and the next year's snow. Into summer and the next year's snow. I know, but harmony is a bit difficult when your voice is synthetic. What? Well, alright. I can think of another. Are you sure? You aren't just humoring me? I assure you there is no reason for that. I do not have feelings, so you cannot hurt them. If you insist then, far be it from me to deny my patience a request so simple. Maurice Snail and Timothy Grub, Swanee and Blue and Emily Grub, decided one day to go into the wood and build them a house and live there if they could. And they stayed there a while, in the trees and the rain till one day to bloom and said you're all insane and to please not come here again they had a green car called happiness runs friday comes and happiness runs out of petrol 
And everyone gets out to push And suddenly see through a gap in the bush A real caravan just like the one in their dreams The wizard doesn't want it For nowadays it seems his home stays in one place and gleams. He told them that he had a horse down the lane. Saturday morning they went back again. He showed them a shed that was built out of tin. He opened the door and they all peered within. And there lying in straw was a horse black as night. With a star on her forehead and eyes full of light. And they all fell in love at first sight. They thought and they thought about having Black Bess. Timothy planted some mustard and cress. They lived in a cupboard and made it their home. And laid there and dreamed of the days when they'd roam. Up and down all the hills of the North Country side. With the dogs eating buttercups on the wayside, and they'd wave all the cities goodbye. Mm Just one more to get you off to sleep. Once I had a child, he was wilder than moonlight. He could do it all like he'd been here before. Once I had a child, she was smiling like sunshine. She could see it all like she'd been here before. Then I had a child. Took his wild like northern summer, and he knows it all like he's been here before. Sleep well. I will be back to check on you in the morning.